Coming in from Jammu and Kashmir and there's crackdown by NIA. There are raids currently underway in Baramulla by the NIA. The raids reportedly linked to terror funding. So currently what we can in fact see that there's raid, raids underway in the Wanbag area of Baramulla district. And uh, the person being raided is a shopkeeper by profession. NIA is continuing with its raids. We've seen the NIA in the recent weeks have in fact conducted multiple raids in different parts of Kashmir. This one happening in Baramulla district where there is crackdown by the NIA and raids underway related to terror funding. Let me go across to my colleague Ishan. Ishan, what are the details we have as of now? What we know so far is that this is the SI, uh, the State Investigating Agency, which was formed on the lines of NIA to investigate and crack any such cases which are regarding uh, these modules are operating in Kashmir with the terror funding. And uh, that seems to be precisely the raid. Uh, one of those is believed to be a shopkeeper. And uh, there are multiple raids going on, not just in Baramula, but we're also the raids are underway in Kupwara, as well as in Poonch uh, district of Jammu Division. Uh, now, we're told that this is regarding the funding of these outfits and that's what NIA has been tasked, SIA has been tasked to honor. And these investigations have been going on through the SIA for been uh, trying to crack down on the modules, but also they have raided, uh, you know, these people who have provided SIM card or logistical support to these OGWs. Those raids have also been carried out by the SIA in the past. But this is a fresh raid that the SIA has carried out. One of, uh, we are just waiting for more details to emerge uh, to who the, they are and what, what, what is their business, because most of them are happy to businessmen, and uh, if they have been involved in providing any kind of logistical support or monetary support. Right, Ishan, we'll, of course, this is a developing update coming in from uh, Baramulla. Thank you so much for joining us with the latest.